Who's the best player outside the top six clubs, the big six in the Premier League? I'm yeah, saying Madison. Not in the six or Ma- the no, but like the traditional big six. Oh, okay. Um, Madison yeah. Madis is up there. Uh, Madison or Saka? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give this. I'm gonna strangle this guy one of these days, bro. <laughs> Ballers and ballets, football fanatics worldwide. This is the old one too. Myself, the black Morton Gantz Pedersen. <laughs> <laughs> the black Maxi Rodriguez. <laughs> you understand? Patty Iniesta, big loon dog. I'm with big Woodsy Goods, the hood's very own batty suitor. Mm-hmm. If I see a goal, I'm beating off. <laughs> Know. You already know what it is, it's Hogan, the right footed left winger, the winger that never shirks a tackle, never pulling that, you already know. Comes inside, Jesus Christ. tucks it away. Mitrovic's brother! <laughs> we catch everything football from international to non-league and everything in between. Mm-hmm. Let's rock with the weekly game. Alright, let's get on to your boys to start with. About my who? <laughs> about my what? It's nothing personal. You get what, what I'm that saying? About? Is that what he said in the promo? Yeah, he done a whole promo video talking about um, it's nothing personal, but I'm coming back and I'm blue. Bro, stop your I foolishness. I, I think that promo was for him coming back to London. No, 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 no. It was, That's man. They just released it yeah. for the Arsenal. Awesome they well, done that time ago. Well, they done foolishness. And you see what it done? It put fire in the man named Belly. Yeah, because even when we was getting into little isms and schisms with their team, oh, I saw red shirts around their players. Yeah. Didn't see no blue shirts. Yeah, it looked like, I don't know, it looked like they didn't have no, they no never, time for They it. had no vim. They had a little personal issue with him. Yeah, but as well, I watched the hardest man in the Arsenal team pause, Granite Jacker hailing him up. Yeah. Before and after the game, big love. Yeah, shout yeah. out to them. Big, big love. Like. Yeah, shout out to them. It's not like, oh, yeah, f him. Like. No, yeah. but, not that. but obviously, at the end of the day, he's, he's going to explain what happened. As it well. was your teammate for a number of years. Do you get what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, you're always going to show him and love. But did he leave or did he get kicked? Who? Abamia. He got kicked, didn't he? Um, yeah, he got well, yeah, like, he yeah. got. It's so, so, so not the same. But he was, he, he was, he was technically he was doing things that wasn't in line to what the manager wanted. And if you don't listen or agree with what a manager wants when he's coming in and trying to change the direction of a club, then he's going to release you or move you on. Yeah, Forget know. the off-the-field stuff. On the pitch, he was terrible for Chelsea. Yeah. I four. think formationally, though, when they went out, when I saw them do the four, I was like, this This was another week, right? Every time I, I look at the Chelsea lineup that gets released, I just look at it and think, Ooh. What the f- is going on here? Yeah. I've done the maths in my head. All right, Reese James is injured. Chilwell's injured. Fafana's injured. Koulibaly was on the bench. Kovacic was injured, so he was on the bench. Kante's injured. They have a lot of injuries, so in, lot of injuries. when we get back from the World Cup, the team will look completely different. But every lineup I see at the minute, it's just Bad. Like, yeah, it looks poor. Well, well all it. you got to do, hold you on, got to go one. there. Another game, you got to get the no job goal. done. Do you yeah. get what I'm saying? One, another game, Jesus, no goal. What's he got? One away goal this season. Bro, he hasn't scored in eight. Nine. I hear that. Nine. One. Nine. Mm-hmm. Sign of the season. <laughs> I don't know what you want from your nine. I, I like, do you know what I'm saying? Darwin's yeah, yeah. getting slandered. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Dude, get, <laughs> dude's, <laughs> dude's dangerous. But yeah, big up, big up, big up. Your defenders are saving you. Do you yeah. know what? That's no. a big win for that's, Arsenal. That's, 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 it's a big bro. win. And Loon's hit the nail on the head. I think now with Saliba and Gabriel, right? Mm-hmm. You've got a physicality where there'll be times on the pitch, it's 2v2 at the back and you can defend it. Mm. It's like when Van Dijk and whether it be Gomez or Matip, Matip or Canati, yeah, Canati, any of them, they yeah. could do it. Mm-hmm. Arsenal look physically good, man. They... I think Liverpool now with Card cannot sorry because you've done it. Yeah. Canati, it has to be. Yeah, yeah, he has to. That's like the closest. Because mm-hmm. yeah. I think is he can World Cup, is it? He has to be. Yeah, he should he be dying. Be. He should be dying. But not Arsenal look good. But you, not... at some stage, and bro. then you know the, the manager came out as well at the end of the game, and he said we was the better team and we deserve to win the game anyway. You definitely deserve to win the you game. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Yeah. And, 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 and terrible it, game. It, it is what it is. I woke up and at that, 60th that, it, it's, it's that old, it's that old <laughs> chant that we got. You know what I'm saying? One nil to the Arsenal, and we'll take them. Yeah, I'll take no, them. Take three, stage, take them. Stay three points, anyhow. But That's... it's just like the game. What time did it start? Off? Twelve o'clock. Half yeah, eleven. Kickoff time. No one plays good at I've that. Just time woke of... up and had a nap. Bro. Yeah. 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 No one, no one plays good at that, that, that time of the day. At some stage, you got to start saying they're in the title race. 
You, you, like I'm, like you I'm, have like to. Like I'm going to keep saying. Yeah? No, you don't have to say that. I'm with you. Like, don't, like, don't like, 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 wins in listen, 13. Hear what I'm Ooh, saying to you. I'm not, I'm not knocking the wins. I'm proud of them boys and what they're doing. They're young boys and they're sticking no together. Pressure on them. It's not even about the pressure. They're already under pressure. Nah. Do you get what I'm saying? And, no and they're, they're, they're under pressure no right pressure. now because... They, they're a young team and everyone's talking about it's them. So, of course, of they're going to be feeling the pressure. It's a game at a time. It's a game at a time. Mm. And I'm saying we need to just look after Christmas. Well, they and 34 points. 34. So, we, they after said Christmas. one team has not won the title from having 34 points from out of the first 30 something. That was Newcastle. Newcastle. Yeah, Newcastle. Well, yeah, if I'm being wins. totally honest. I would put my money that Arsenal don't win it, though. Man I'm with you, but they should be putting pressure on themselves. Like in the change room, no the, pressure. The, mani- pressure don't the, the manager, them. the manager, and the teammates. Like players will be turning around to their teammates. They'll be saying, "This is a chance for a lifetime." One hundred percent. They're not going to be saying because I don't think like if you do win it, yeah, mm-hmm. I don't think you're going to now monopolize English football. No. I think Man City will switch it up yeah. and then run exactly. it again. Yeah, you, you know got, what I'm saying? So yeah. it might be like a smash and grab like Liverpool or a smash and grab when Leicester, Leicester. done it. Mm-hmm. Do you get what I'm saying? So you've got to literally take it. You've got to take it. But also, you've got to keep composure. These are kids. Yeah, they have and, to. And exactly. Yeah. And you've got to understand, <laughs> Man City ain't going to make it easy. Absolutely. No, they're they're right not. on their heels. Of course they're not. But I'm saying, you lot shouldn't be looking at too Anyone far else. behind you now. You shouldn't be worrying about Tottenham, Man Just look ahead, innit? Look ahead, go for it. But I think like, like I think the games, the game like obviously the form teams in the league are yourselves, Newcastle, Man City. You ain't played either of them. No, no they haven't. Haven't. that's what I'm saying. Those they are the form haven't. teams yourself, Newcastle. Like, I, I see Arsenal fans. I'll be playing all the big teams, but you know like the big teams you have played yeah. are going through transitions yeah. or having bad form and that, and you lost to United, yeah. who out of the big teams you played probably is the worst one, yeah. and you lost to him. Mm-hmm. So. It's just like, that's what I'm saying. Just take it a game at that's a time. That's what I mean. And that's what I've been yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I say every week. Time, <laughs> All right, let's go on to Unai. Yeah. Another ex-Arsenal man. He had his first game at Villa. Being yeah. United Pick up yourself, Unai, man. Welcome back to the Prem. Um, how did you feel about this one? Do you know what? United, similar like I was just saying with Chelsea, I looked at that lineup and I said, uh, it looked horrible. It looked horrible. And then when the game started, the game's done in 10 minutes. Mm. You go away from home and you're 2-0 down in 10 minutes. You're done. Especially United aren't scoring goals. They get an own goal just before half time. Perfect time to get it. You think, all right, go in the changing room. G up. Players and managers G up saying the next mm-hmm. goal, if we get it, we win. And within two minutes, you give up the next like, goal. Like, it's crazy though, because shambles. two, two, three weeks ago, mm. Villa's getting managers sacked and that. And yeah. now they're just beating Man United and that. Yeah. I reckon under Gerard, they could have beat Man United. <laughs> <laughs> like, I've seen Donny van der Beek and like, I was like, bro, like, I don't know to what I, I was think, watching it. I think and you know how you poor United are these like I swear you lot weren't even on TV. No, I weren't on TV. <laughs> it weren't on TV. <laughs> Big Big <laughs> Sunday, you know. Man, Man could watch yeah, Everton and all that. TV. Man United. Man can watch Man U, bro. <laughs> I had to go nah. on my fire stick. Not that I'm streaming games illegally. I have. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what though? It, it was just bad. You mentioned Van der Beek. I think that was his last audition. Like he's had People saying he ain't had a chance. He's had one too many. You he's think? Just, exactly. Nah, man. They I think they've dealt with him bad since they did. He's trying just, to build his confidence bro, back he's up. He's never in a million years a Man United player. Never in a million years. Well, I reckon he is. But when you first signed him, he's a good signing. But Ole shot, from the first sign, shot his confidence. Yeah, the first, shot his confidence. first time we signed him, I said at the start, I did not like that signing. He got in the yeah, European, like he got in the Champions League team of the year. That's fine. All That's that, fine. man. That was a good season for him, man. Do you know good what? Season. When you're going to those sort of him big Dele, clubs, when those sort, of, those sort of big clubs, you need personality and character. He's not got it in him. His stats from the last two games are embarrassing. Dutch, Dutch players usually, they it's really hard for them to mould in at mm-hmm. um, like proper character clubs because Dutch people are usually timid. He like, looks like he that, way too usually very humble. I honestly, and, I couldn't tell you except where he goes next. In but they're professional as well. You, you know, know what I mean? They're look professional, but they yeah. just want to go into work and go home. They're on this banter, setting fire <laughs> to shoes and all them stupid <laughs> things. Yeah, now that was a bad result for us at the weekend. Um, City. City is City. They go 1-0 up, give away a penalty in the 25th, 26th mm-hmm. minute. Cancelo sent off, 1-1. One, one. That weren't a pen. That weren't a sending off. It was a harsh sending off. Harsh, that. very harsh. Oh, crazy. Um, yeah. And then... They still go on to have Ugh. 72% of the ball, 706 passes, yeah, part, and a 90 minute game, they, winner. But they, that's they, City, man. They're playing in the centre circle and in and around. Like They're not in the final third having all these passes. What do you think Fulham should have done? Fulham, Fulham, FIFA, Fulham were half confused whether to press 10 men or whether to sit off. 
I think they got. I think they got. Yeah, gung ho it. Gengar press. Gung ho it. Gung ho it. You got. You got. You got five subs as well, innit? Yeah. Gung ho it, man. Press that. Gung ho it, man. Yeah. Go for it. Yeah. Say to the fullback, stay. See, I think Fulham got a bit too brave. Everybody else. Including goalie, get that ball. <laughs> no, <yeah. laughs> get the goalie bomb in the back, bro. I think they could. I think they should have pressed more, and, and I think they should have gone at them a bit more. I would have brought Bobby they... Cordivia Reed. <laughs> Reed. Yeah, big yeah. up Bobby Cordivia. <laughs> <laughs> they give up his ex teammate as well. Yeah. Um, uh, Fulham are doing all right though. I think they're eighth now. They're doing good, man. They're, they're having I a thought good they season. were shooting to get ready. No Mitrovic this weekend. Are we having that he's injured or no. is he doing one of them ones which I know a lot of people do when they say it's a top four team away from home. Need to keep the stats looking good. What? I thought you were saying um, you wanted to just do it for the World Cup. Why wouldn't he want to play football? Bro, there's I, I don't know, a certain man. player. Do you know what it is? I'll tell you after. You look through his history. Never played a game against a top four, especially away from home. Top player as well? Not top player, but Premier League player for about eight to ten years striker. Who is it? I'll tell you after. <laughs> he, uh, he and was, what he would say to the gaffer like, you're my main guy no no he'd say to the players he'd say I'm throwing one in this weekend he's saying I'm not playing and messing up my stats if did I he play, play with you the season against them I never played with me so why, 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 why wouldn't players say shut up man and come and play you're costing us games facts, facts. you know what I'm saying I don't big know facts. he never played alongside That's me and nah. um, but big win that for Man City big Pe- win Pep big celebrating win. was it a pen <laughs> or was it soft it's soft by That's the pen. soft it it's, it's poor from the defender. I don't know what he's doing. You don't, yeah. Stand up, isn't it? Stand up. The boy's got his back to goal. Mm. Well, well, it, it was a soft pen, but they give him, man. You yeah. don't give the opportunity. Yeah. You don't give no one opportunity. You know what I mean? To, but they, 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 they're City, man. They dug it out. They got the win. And that's I get what you need to do. The best, thing that, the best thing you can say about City... What time was the goal? What time was it? 95th. Mm. That's why they celebrated. The best thing you can say about City, right, is they got the sending off in the 25th minute and you still expected them to win. Yeah, like you didn't expect yeah. them to go and lose. I think I think the only team that you can't beat with ten men is Manchester City. Facts. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, Facts. Like, yeah. I've seen Liverpool get ten men and they five nil us. Like five <laughs> nil us. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. If there's eleven men, they don't five nil up. They need yeah. to just. But there's, there's City, a hole. They they will make pop. City play with ten every week, man. Yeah, even up the league. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> even that up. <laughs> Liverpool two one away at Spurs. Yeah. Yeah. Salah back amongst the goals, banging yeah. in the brace. Him and him and Nunez linking up well. Him and Nunez. Nunez um, playing out to the left. Um, but he, he still was a front two. A narrow left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I, you know what? I like him. You know, he's yeah. growing on me. His his, his thoughts. His thoughts are are, are, are are training ground thoughts. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's not like, no disrespect, yeah? Like, Jesus is not clinical. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? He's not clinical. He's a good player. Yeah, but good. But him running one-on-one with a goalie, I won't put a better pound on him. Yeah, yeah, Do you know yeah. what I mean? But, but he, he knows how clinical. More instinctive yeah, you know, at the minute. Yeah, he's, he's but, but he, like, yeah, he's... You put him in, he won't like open his body. He won't be able to yeah. round like like Nunes leaves the ball behind. But when that ball catches up, it's <laughs> wallet. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? Isn't it? He hit the post, hit the bar, a couple good saves out of Loris as well. Like it's just I like you, I like Salah's second finish, the little dink. Dink, yeah. Oh, that was that was, nice. that was was very nice. First one was nice, touch bang. But it like, lifted. So, yeah, yeah. Um, was, yeah. Uh, is Conte under pressure? No way. He will be, but not now. No way is he under pressure. He under pressure. They're, they're you know what it is? top four. No, what will be under pressure for him is his contract's running down and he mm-hmm. keeps arguing about I need signings, signings, signings. They're not going to give you signings if you've got six months left on your deal. I hate you, but, but, but he's like, look, I'm, the signings ain't mine. They're not in my pocket. Yeah. These, yeah. these he's players like, I'm, I'm going to buy, they're gonna, I'm going to leave them with you. Lot. I so, know, <laughs> but a lot of Conte signings in general are normally older players, so Tottenham won't want to do that. But who he's brought in, Kuvale- well, Kuvaleski. Brilliant. Yeah. Con- uh, uh, Benton, Benton Cole. Cole. Yeah. So Basuma looked good as well. Mm-hmm. He's bringing good, good players. Good signings, the, the, yeah. All them defenders, Romero, long leg. They, he's bringing a, a younger, fresher squad. Like, I still thought Tottenham was playing with older ball world. Romero's there before. What? Well, bringing, bringing fruit then, wherever. I still thought they were playing Oldable World in Vertonga, bro. <laughs> like, I don't know who they had back there, bro. You know what I'm saying, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I see Oliver Skip with the number four. Do you know four, what? But... Tottenham in a little crossroads. <coughs> Conte was six months left, say, right? Mm-hmm. Harry Kane's going to have a year in six months. And they want signings. Kane's going to look for Conte to sign first. Conte's going to look for signings first. Tottenham are going to want Kane and Conte signed up first. Mm-hmm. It's just all Liverpool in Liverpool are sniffing around Son. Does um does uh oh, that would be a marvelous signing actually by the way like for Liverpool up, that would be crazy him on one player. side I know Nunes is a bit rough in the middle but <laughs> 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 I 
Jim <laughs> <laughs> Bob, you got a year, innit? It's Jim Bob, you got a year to sleep, um, didn't you? Uh, well, does Kane stay? I, I, think, I think come May, Tottenham have no Champions League football. Conte's gone, and I think Harry Kane, maybe not in May, but before the end of the window, he goes. Where? Goes where? That, that I don't know. Bayern. Exactly. I think he's just going to stay in England to get the all time record in the Prem. If he believes he can get it, what is he? I don't think there's no way for him to go. Where does he go in England? He's not going to Liverpool. Um, not going to Newcastle. United will go for him. United? United will go for him. Whether he wants to do it or not, it's up to him, but they'd yeah, definitely oh, be interested. That's a good signing. That's a good signing for him. Oh, they'd be yeah. interested. It would be a good, good signing. signing for him, but I don't know if he'd want to go. But what about if Newcastle got top four? Because they won at the weekend. Exactly, four, that's what I mean. It may four, be Newcastle. Four shots on target, four goals. Almiron. 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 Grealish, hey, you need an apology, man. No, man, let hey. me do this to talk about Darwin. That's it. We need Grealish to talk about Darwin, or you lot need him to talk about Laka. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, not Laka, um, Hazen. <laughs> hey, that's what I'm guy. saying, same he dude. Didn't mention Laka, that's my boy. Same dude, though. Laka, <laughs> Hazen, same guy, bro. Uh, you know what I'm or ESR or whatever. Newcastle looking good, though. They're very good. Almiron, like Look, Conference League's good for them. Europa League's good for yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. I think Champions League's is a strap, a, a reach. I don't know, though, man. Like, anything can happen, man. It can, but I'm just saying, look, no disrespect, yeah? Mm hmm. But England Premier League football can't afford to go into the Champions League next year with Arsenal and Newcastle. We <laughs> can't. We can't. That's straight yeah, out. Yeah. That's straight yeah. out. Straight, that both of you are not going to be unseeded. Like bo <laughs> both of you can be unseeded. You can get a group with Bayern, Real. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? You can get them. You're basically Mahib the Pfeiffer. Do you know what I'm saying? Isn't it? You're basically she's Sheriff. You're going into the Champions no, League. And you ain't anyway. been you ain't been in there for five years, you lose a league. Five or six. Without five, five years, no Champions League, you're not seeded. So you was always like number two seed because you never won it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So you're in the number three. But Third. I think now, don't now, I think number one seeds are all the champions. Number two seeds are the second place. No. I'm sure it's like that no, now. Yeah, that's man. right. It's no. right. It's right. Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. It changed like two, three years ago. That's what it is. That's why you mm -hmm. keep seeing the big teams getting knocked out. Oh. So Arsenal might be the main seed if they go and win it. Oh, maybe. Well, well, well. Must be nice. Must be. Yeah. Fuck how Barcelona. <laughs> fucking just Barcelona, Dortmund. <laughs> yeah, your thing still hey, got Barcelona might have no players come next year, brother. They'll, they'll just bring you get me. Academy, you know Wait, academy how, how good a job's Eddie Howe doing? Because see, yeah. when they first got the takeover mm -hmm. with the money, his appointment. It was like a steady appointment. Yeah. His, his appointment's not a done deal, bro. Yeah, it's They're not. They're waiting for but, some cool grey-haired dude but, that smokes cigarettes. But you see, They're waiting for that. You, see they, you know what I'm saying? The fashion manager, bro. But why he's doing well? If they were sat eighth now, they'd probably be looking at whether it be Tuchel or Pochettino, whoever. They'd probably mm. look at the name. It's impossible they can look elsewhere mm. at the minute. You see Rafa? Rafa's all like, hey, I'm back here, yeah. I'm here. <laughs> Hey, do you know what? But I don't, I, I, I don't think Eddie Howe's a bad manager. He ain't. No, he's doing well. And, he, and, he, and, he, and he's, he's, he's got that. He loses change room stuff. Yeah, yeah, but he's yeah, got he that squad him. together right now. He's galvanised that dressing he's got room. Like a Bournemouth boy is them. Yeah. And, he, and, and he's got like what you, like what uh, Simo was saying. He's got, got the like, characters. he's got the characters. Mm -hmm. You see the main guys in that change room. Yeah. They're on his side. But I'm telling you now. Like, as soon as that Isaac starts being his main number nine, Callum's gonna kick off. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna yeah. all, you know what I'm saying? It's sh like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we'll see how it you know goes. You know what I'm saying, man. innit? We'll see how it pans. Like, happened with your guy? Dude. At Forest. Oh, Lau. Lau, yeah. <laughs> Top boy in the champ. Sign up couple players. <laughs> man, he's got a number, bro. <laughs> Just saying. He's got a number. He's, he's got, got a number. number. What number is he? Uh, I can't Did remember. Did they take his number off him? No, he, he, he's got one of them. Squad numbers. Them, them. High numbers. The higher numbers anyway, oh. he plays with a higher number. Oh. All right, we're going to get to the other results, which are normally a bit boring, but this week they look all right. Yeah, a couple Everton of nil, uh, Leicester two, Tillyman's another banger. Oh, no. Who scored the other one? Like... Who scored the other one again? Harvey Barnes. Oh, yeah, Harvey yeah, Barnes. Right, that was a decent goal yeah, as well. Slapped it. Two man has, Tillyman, has Tillyman signed a new contract yet? No. No. Nope. He can sign a free contract in January with any foreign club. Yeah, this getting techie for them. It's getting techie. Arsenal might get him. Yeah. Not for a club. No, but in January we might just throw in a little cheapo. 10, 15 million. You're like, bro, you're gonna join the queue. Everyone's gonna <laughs> drop that little bread, bread in. Yeah, bro. yeah. Well, boy, well, that's how it goes. You get me. And it's about what you can offer. Like, you know, some some man is gonna say, "Yo, take this little youth, man. 15 m's." Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Innit? And take you know this goalie. Yeah, man. We get a Reese Nelson, man. <laughs> that's good business. <laughs> Great business. Exactly. Great business. There the good, you go. The good thing about Tillyman's, a lot of players in the last year, they kind of protect themselves from getting injured. 
He this just, guy, yeah, he's just, just balling out every week. Yeah, he's shout playing. out to him. Even though his contract's running down, he ain't playing no games. That's yeah, a, if you was watching him, you wouldn't say he's in the last year of his and, and let's be honest, that, <laughs> that, that, that stands him in good stead for any team that 100. wants to sign him. Just lets, like, he, he, won't, he won't run, like, not he won't run back, but he will let the he game run He struggles to yeah. run back. Yeah, he, he, he will let the game run past him. That's why I don't think that like, Klopp's probably gone in. Yeah. Like, he likes mm. high energy. You see, if you had T. Lehmans now in the Liverpool, say, two years ago when the midfield was all pressing, you could bring him in now and then for Thiago. Do you know what I mean? If Thiago was injured or resting him. But you couldn't play them both together or... I know what you mean. Like, he doesn't have that desire to run. Yeah, he doesn't. Mm. What else Um, we got, brother? Madison was on fire that game. Another shot. Madison, yeah, big up Madison. Who's the best player outside the top six clubs, the big six in the Premier League? I'm you saying Madison. Madison in the six. Or Ma- no, but like the traditional big six. Oh, okay. Um, Madison, yeah. Madison is up there. Um, Madison or Saka? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give this. I'm gonna strangle this guy one of these days, bro. Oh. <laughs> hey, let us know who you think the best player outside the traditional big six in the Premier League is. Go on, the comments. I've seen a few shouts for like Wilfred Zaha. No. Players like that. Wilf, Wilf's, the, Wilf's always been the truth, bro. He's yeah, cool. Bro, he's good. Look, look. This he's is good. A, he's Wilf, very it's good. This is what I say. Mm. Do you like how a player looks or do you like what he can do? Mm. Wolf has no end product. He has no end product. He doesn't, he doesn't have no, he doesn't have any product. No. no end product? None. Doesn't score enough goals, doesn't assist enough. That's why they started getting him on penalties. He doesn't score, bro. He got oh, two seasons. He got he go a season with two goals. They started giving him penalties <laughs> last year. Tell you All right, right, let's yeah. go on to Lee's Bournemouth. Lee's 1-0 up. 3-1 down, bring it back to 4-3. That little My Summer guys, Summerville, Summerville you know. First name, Ascenso. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Summerville. You know the name's Cole. Jamaican people. <laughs> hey. Allow it, man. Hey. The Mario's and the Ronaldo's. <laughs> Expecting to see a little Spanish kid come in and see a little black kid with cane rolls. <laughs> oh, your dad watched the 94 World Cup. I see it. Do you know what I'm saying, innit? Hey, no, nah, Somerville's doing his thing, brother. He's good, man. He's got three goals. I think it's 84th, 86th, Clutch. and 90th minute. Clutch. He's moving like, like Steph uh, Curry. Splash Curry. boys. Like, yeah. Splash yeah. boys, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. He's yeah. doing good. Now, Leeds done well to come back from that. It's poor from Bournemouth because Leeds looked the shambles at one stage in that game. Bro, mm-hmm. half time of an American coach. Imagine how he's g him up. Come on, boy. <laughs> who's, who's that, who's that um, the other kid for uh, Leeds? The Gon- short black guy. Gonto. Gonto. Ooh, Bro. that kid's got legs. Do you see the way he bro- <laughs> Do you see the way he broke out the defense? Trust yeah, yeah. me. And started bro. just riding that. To be moving that fast and that ma- rapid with a ball is crazy. Yeah. That was crazy. <laughs> yeah, no, he, he's raps. He done well. Hey, you need to see the celebration for the fourth goal. Some of your scores, Gonto's trying to get involved. Someone pushes him. Hits the deck, roly poly, but the momentum's still in the short body, so he hits the deck again. <laughs> bro, everyone else is off at this stage. What do you mean, like? Yeah. Oh, like a, like a, like a, like a pin. Yeah. 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 No. Oh, I was dying, but good result for Leeds. Two, yeah, two wins back to back. West Ham lost at home to Palace. Yep. Yeah. Olise, injury time winner. Yeah. Like no. Olise, <laughs> Eze, those are the creators at Palace. That's what I'm saying. Like Zaha scored, it was a mistake, innit? Yeah. It fell to him, bang. Don't get me wrong, he'll do that. Mm. But Wolf is just rolls and, 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 and miserable faces. Yeah. Olise it, is like, quality, quality, quality. Quality, quality, quality. He reminds me Eze of is a young quality. Morris. Yeah, I like Eze. Yeah, Eze is brilliant. Eze. Eze is quality as well. And Olise, you always get ratings because the streets never forget that DM you sent, man. <laughs> it was so <laughs> right, Yo, like, I'm not ready for a bit, but yeah, I'm going to bigger things because championship. <laughs> you know, what do you mean? Near it down. Trust yeah, just me. me. Like his interview afterwards was uh, just as it is. They said, oh, talk us through the goal. He says, oh, Will passed me the ball. I shot, I scored. <laughs> That's <laughs> it. Boom. He's like, yeah, but um, how did it feel? He's like, it was great. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. He, yeah. But he's French, English. He speaks like he's been here a long time. Yeah, yeah. So because like, in, sure in, in, in FM, he's definitely French. No, yeah. in FM, I think man, when he's English. Oh, he oh, might maybe have got nationality. Yeah, yeah, yeah I think yeah, he's yeah, like, yeah. like declaring for France been here, now. Because he's been here from, from so young. That's uh, mad. Yeah, Wolves, cool. they got a new manager coming in, by the way, Lope Tegli. Mm-hmm. And he been here before? No, he's been, he was at Seville last, Real Madrid, Spain. Oh, they got him, they didn't get the, um, the other guy that they were going to get Watford's old guy. No, 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 not mm-hmm. going for him. So mm-hmm. yeah, Lope Tegli's coming in. Mm-hmm. They were 1 0 down to Brighton. Lalana, lovely goal. Great goal, yeah. Wolves went 2 1 up. Then 2-2 two, two and a red card, and then they lost it. Yeah. But Wolves oh. are poor, man. They're just boring. 
boring yeah, I like Ruben Neves, man. I think dude's crazy with it. The, sun, I like the celebration. <laughs> runs off, like, you should know better. You should not. Like, I, like, I like Neves. I think he might possibly be out he's the door. Gone, um, he's a Man United player. That's why I look at him and think. Ruben Neves? Yeah, I look at him you know in what, a Man bro? United shirt and he's like a fawn. Like, you know, like that game and it's tight against Arsenal yeah. Liverpool. And he would just go boom. Like, no, the only thing with Neves, right? Like him and Tillyman's both very good players. Don't run a lot. Yeah. So and in the Man United team, we don't run as it is. Like, you um, couldn't play like Neves, Neves and N- Eriksson. Like, Neves, like, Neves. The, the, the thing, the thing with, the, the thing with, <laughs> the, but the thing about it, the thing with Neves and Tillyman's is this year. In pre-season, them man have got that steady stride. They will be at the front of the running doing that steady stride not all yeah, day long. Yeah, but Do you know really what I mean? There, but boy. the pace is not... The acceleration and the pace is not 100% there, but they got that steady no, legs you're getting to get it. around What we're saying is like, yeah, the ball's there in front. They will in like as soon as you go there, it's done. They'll turn, but they won't chase you. Yeah, yeah because yeah, they ain't got the acceleration to get back. They ain't got the mobility. Yeah, they ain't got mobility. So like, even as good as players they are, someone... Just picking a name like a Onana, he'd be better at Man United, where he just can get about the pitch. Mm. He's haven't got players. Any goal pitch? No, the Everton midfielder. I think it might be his brother. <laughs> Is it? No, no. Oh, <laughs> not in a forest. Brentford. Hey, did you see before the game the little arguments they had? No, what happened? Like the goalkeeping coach, I think at Brentford with the ground staff. Ground staff must have hit him with the like the pitch fork. Is it? Walls or something? Yeah. What are you trying to do? Leave a little wet patch yeah. in the goal? And then do that. I don't like the result for Forest, man. They're getting to the stage where home games against, I think, Bournemouth they lost. Brentford, uh, Brentford yeah. they drew. They beat Liverpool. They lost to Fulham. At home they need. They're to getting get relegated, man. Do you think? Yeah, man. I think they're going to. Back to the slum. They're getting the relegated. Do you reckon that big goal that time? You can leave time a little <laughs> yeah, bit bigger. Trust me. So you're saying <laughs> half time. Yeah, the short yeah, yeah, the short <laughs> rap I got the two. Whack, like get it. I'm saying, isn't it? Maybe. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna get on to the other weekly roundup results. Mm-hmm. Or not even really the results, the draws. The draw, the draw, up. the weekly Champions draws. League. Champions League, Whoa, Europa. Let's do the Europa League playoff for the playoffs for the playoffs. Playoffs. Yeah, this is a shambles. <laughs> you got Barca versus Man United. Who'd you mm-hmm. get? You, you going for that? But we're not going to find out the results of this soon. Or it's At na- right now, as it stands, I'd pick Barcelona. Obviously, in three, four months, when you have to all the teams. I just want to know what you felt about. Oh uh, yeah, I, I think Barca right now are favourites. Depends what the injuries are like in the coming months, but yeah, Barca. And Xavi's acting like that. Yeah, we need a centre back to this. Go by centre back. Mm. So he's talking. Pete yeah. Gone. Let's go through the Champions League, though. I need your predictions. They're not set in stone predictions. <laughs> set in it's stone. Months away. Yeah, months away. AC Milan, Tottenham. Tottenham. I'm going to go Tottenham. I'll go Tottenham. Man City, Leipzig. Oh, sorry. Yeah, Leipzig, Man City. Man hmm. City all day. All day. City. Yeah, like 11 injuries, bro. Rush them. <laughs> Bruges against Benfica. Ooh. Benfica. Ooh, Bruges top their group, though. Didn't they? Mm. Bruce finished second in their group. Oh, they were top for a lot of the time. Porto t- overtook them on, on the last, last game. Day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm going Bruce. Yeah, I'll man. go Benfica. I'll Cause... go Benfica. They somehow always get to like the quarters. It's crazy. Yeah, no, it's Porto somehow always get to the quarters. Not Benfica. Benfica played Liverpool quarters last year. Didn't That's it? one time because we, but we usually play Porto there. Yeah, we have Porto every yeah, game. Li- Liverpool, right? Ra- Real. I'll give it to us. You know, I think over two games, even that old Champions League final. I'll go Real. Even though Champions League final, like even that last one, one nil, double like, that whole game, that, yeah. whole game, whole game, just missed chances. Man. Courtois, man of the match, says it all. Yeah, Dortmund against Chelsea. Right now, it's Dortmund. Right now, Dortmund. Yeah. In, what's his name? In Cuckoo. Not in Cuckoo. Uh-huh. That's, that's Leipzig. Um, what's their one? Makoko. Makoko. Brother. Oh, he sees brace. No, I didn't see. Bro, yeah, he's super dope. Bro, he's got a brace. He's got a y- y- Yeboah thing. No way. <laughs> Seventeen. <laughs> to Google him, like this is a ringer, bro. <laughs> what dom? <laughs> Off the bar, the goal was shaking, bro. <laughs> hey, crazy. Frankfurt, Napoli. 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 They're on fire. In a Porto. In a. It won't be easy, but no, I'm going to have Inter. I'm going to go Porto. Do you know what? This is the one that stands out for me, along with Liverpool Real, Paris Bayern. That's it. That see what? The say, I watched it on stream. Watched yeah. it live. When it's like showing you who you can draw, yeah. I was like, no, I don't want. 
And I say Trent, like, Trent's defender's not a problem. Mm-hmm. I just don't want Mane running at him. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Isn't it? I just don't want Mane <laughs> running at Trent. Like, I know you. You see, Do you know you what I'm saying? I, I don't that, want that. That one there, that one there could have the winner. No. I yeah, I think you're. You, I think that, that one, that one, one there, that no one there, that is a base. That's a fight. That's the fight. That's that is my, a final right there. My top three for the Champions League with those two and City. So whichever one of those get through will be favourite. Yeah, who? For me. So who's your fight? Bayern, City, Bayern, and, and Paris. PSG. So basically, Bayern's gonna win it. No, no new team wins Champions League. It don't happen like that. Not just dropping and win it. Like I've got money and win it today. That uh, midfield of PSG weird, don't win. It's a weird it. season, man. I get it. That midfield of PSG don't win that. PSG is coming along well. Vitinha, got good midfield depth now, though, man. Vitinha, Verratti's good. Fabian Ruiz. Oh, bro, man. Renato Sanchez. They got depth in the midfield. Oh, no, they got a bit of depth now. Bro, they, they make good signings. Of, was it Leon Gortzka? Bro, they got that, 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 that. Kimmich. The thing that worries on. me for Paris, right? What worries me for Paris is with their big three players, two of them, at least two of them, will end up getting a stick from the World Cup because at least two of them won't win it. Mm-hmm. So Dennis, how they react in the coming months? It, might, it might put a fire in I think in their Messi belly. wins it, Messi don't come back. I think Messi wins it, he stays so, out so in if Qatar. So if Messi <laughs> stays in Qatar, bro. <laughs> if Messi wins it, that means Mbappe and Neymar, they're going to be blamed for their country failing by their press. Yeah, whatnot. but they, they might come back and be like, look, boys, listen, we've got to win this Champions League, man. Yeah, hopefully. That should be a good game, though. Definitely one to watch. That'll be... That'll Mbappe be knows what he wants to do if he wants to win the Champions League. Our billionaire owners, that our new talking it to an existence. <laughs> yeah, my, our billionaire owners... Then pull up, get us Bellingham, Mbappe, and obviously sign me <laughs> as uh, do you know what I'm saying? Online type. Yeah! <laughs> LSC TV or somebody. Oh, uh, my Lose, God. Bags oh a week. God. Lose, what made the feed? What made the feed this week, brother? Referee for Kundo Tello. Mm-hmm. Had to show That's 10 cold, red man. cards. In the Argentine cards. Cup final between Boca Juniors and Racing Club after a melee was sparked in front of the Boca Juniors fans when the Racing Club player scored the winner in the 118th minute. 118th minute? That's extra time, obviously. Yeah. But... <laughs> Woodsy was thinking it was time, I did all. I know, like... <laughs> uh, Argentina, Argentina, the South American football is always volatile. It's crazy, isn't it? It's always a bit volatile, man. Boca ended up losing the final, yeah? Yeah. So, I've... Uh, Ah, man, the first red card happened on the 90th minute. 90th minute. So, Steve, Stefan Villa and Jose Carbonario <laughs> had a fight. <laughs> <laughs> same, same, man. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Hey. Bruv, you men are role models for the picnic, bruv. 10 or no. You get me? <laughs> this is when the club has to... Um, it's just going like that. He's just slapping red cards all over the place. He's just doing it to... Yellow bro, well, a couple of red. them will be rescinded, bro. And look, you know what? He's got yellows as well, so he's like, yeah. bam, bam. I'm like, what? I do you even remember I'm booked? Do you know what I'm saying? Like, I do, like look, he's just jogged off. Oh, bro. You know what? Man's getting um, sent off for like, holding his arm. And like, no, you, don't, you can't send him off. I'm like, what? <laughs> hey, yeah. I want to be a referee. It's crazy out there, man. Send off everybody. <laughs> Send off man in front of the day, gal and that. <laughs> you don't remember yeah. that referee back in the day when the clips was going around. When he's sending them off, he's moving strange. Oh, yeah. Then he's to bring him back for the World Cup. Yeah, yeah, he was cold, man. <laughs> um, what else has made it? Um, Emilio Martinez, my World Cup winning goalkeeper. You see him setting up the wall. I see it. He's going to do that for Messi, the second best free kick taker. I um, see it. He's going to do that. And, and you understand? Uh, like, was, and, he, and, like, and, was he actually setting up the wall? Was he bantering? No, no he's setting up the so, Aston Villa wall in front of the Man United so, wall. So the goalie can't see it? Yeah. I guess so, I guess so, I, I guess so. I think it's just one of them new added extra things they do nowadays. Yeah, just a bit extra. I'm going to give you a like new added they, thing, what happens in When football. the players lie under the wall. Yeah. Uh, I can't stand Bro, all that. Bro, Coutinho's put so many under it, though. Yeah, but not this free kick was that amazing from Digny, though. It reminded me of Fabio Rubio's against Shores at Old Trafford. Yeah. You know what I mean? That Decent crazy. free kick as well. But it's just a new... That? Uh, Lucas Digno. Okay, yeah, Luca Digno. Like, I like, the, the, I like the setup of the wall, the two... The two. It's, it's, it's good, man, because it, it stops the sight. It's just it like... It does what stop you're the saying, sight. Do you know what, though? I'm not happy with that free kick anyway. 
the players complained at the time. The referee took him 12 yards back instead of 10. Like, come on, man. Oh, what's 12 yards and step the extra two and say, can't hit again? They're stepping forward and he's not having it. They made a big deal of it before the free kick was taken. Casemiro and him are arguing for about 30, 45 seconds about it. The referee's just saying, no, get back there. He's even saying they took the ball further back. So now, like, it's 12 yards or more. Mm. Oh, well, well, well boy. Yeah, there's that. Yeah, pff, I don't know. And United have got to put up a bit more of a fight then. Billionaires! What's going on though? Because the statement was like they kind of just want more shareholders, stakeholders at that area. I don't know. I, look, I'm not a man. You'll never ever see me say to the owners, get out. Yeah. I'm not one of those, man. I don't, I don't get yeah, it. Yeah, I don't rate all that. I don't, I don't get it, man. The yeah. team's playing poor and they're screaming at the old men in the suits. Like, hey, <laughs> what? <Yeah. laughs> like, no, what are we doing here? There's no. There's no investment. We got a 75 million pound defender, but yeah. okay. Uh, yeah, we, got like, six, we got a 70 million pound goalie. Okay. Like, we got much? a 64 million pound bad yes. touch striker. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I'm saying, 100%. Like we can't, everything can't be a bargain. I get it. Um, but cool, man. I think if there's any team that deserves like to have an unlimited amount of riches, it's Liverpool. Man. <laughs> <laughs> One of the most successful teams ever. If any team deserves it, them. Yeah. Yeah, because what about Burton Albion and them teams? No, because right. it's going to take too long for it to happen. Yeah. I'm just saying, if you as an owner want to own a successful football club, yeah, our, our modules like stepping into like, see, Newcastle's hard graft, Arsenal's right? probably hard graft because your owners are a bit stiff. Yeah, they're you not see, selling. Hypoth- <coughs> hypothetically, if you was the guy with all these billions, right, taking over a club, would you want to do a club with the history in that? Or would you want to do like a Newcastle or how Man City got... So how could they get a Nottingham Forest? They got a bit of history. This is what I'm but they got money though. That's what this blue... Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 they're getting, what would they're you, getting what fucking two Would you, would you want to take a Liverpool or Man United or would you want to take a Man City? Uh, the way you answer that time. question, yeah, yeah, is who do you pick on football manager? United. There you go. So, no, but that's, that's like a that, manager, not an owner. Yeah, but that's the same thing. You're picking it because you want to buy who you want to buy straight away. That's why you're picking them, innit? I guess so. But Do you get me? Like, me and you, I, I reckon you would go and try and build a smaller club. Even though you love Arsenal, I reckon you try and build a smaller I know club. I'm playing with Fulham on yeah, the manager right now. Yeah. I mean, I've, done, I've started 40 manager on Rangers, Everton. I'm a Liverpool man. You know what I'm saying? No, I've got I'm small saying, clubs and try and make but, them great. But on a footy man, I want to like manage the best players, innit? I'm saying if I had unlimited funds as an owner, like those man, but you could do man, that those, at those, those, those Man City owners, right? They haven't just made the best team that there is. They've changed Manchester. Not like even Manchester. Manchester. They've got a company, like Melbourne City. Remember? Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, they have all of like them. Man's been um, Australia. Remember yeah. in Sydney. So when they were playing, Melbourne City was playing. They had like the Manchester, yeah, the old Manchester the, City bus. The like they, they look like Manchester City. Mm. This is what I'm saying. The kids, New York City, look like Manchester City. Mm-hmm. Do you know what yeah. I mean? Even like when, when you go out in Manchester nowadays. When did they take over? 2009, I think. You've got was. that um, like, city's changed yeah, way the city, for the better. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, like they, right they near really the Etihad, they got this like um, uptown. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Oh, is it? Bougeness. North, North, Bougeness. Right, I've been up there in time. North, North, Bougeness, North. All right, for the tactical breakdown, we could have picked any of the three goals that United conceded at the weekend. Um, Shambles, really. So what one are you going to pick? Um, we're going with the first one. You're seven minutes into a game away My from home. My guy, big up Tibley Gardens, finest. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Kingston, yeah. shower pass here. Man, take up here. More best. Stand yeah. up. Yeah. Green banana and yeah, Everybody, yams. Leon Bailey, top goal. Uh, so first goal, seven minutes in yeah. away from home. M Ray's first game and they score. Did it hurt it did, but when I saw the team news, I was already downbeat and deflated. I see you. I'll be I, real. I'm done with you, man. I'll be real. No, I thought the team news, it was a bit of arrogance. A bit of arrogance. That When you put out that line-up, that's to say I'm going away from so home. I'm going to lose the ball. No, I knew that it'd be a struggle. You never know if you're going to lose or not. You can only guess what the performance will be like. So but... what about Martinez? The guy, Martinez Mar- looks Mar- slow, Mar- Mar- boy. Martinez. Bailey's striding Mar- in that. Martinez, who's had a brilliant season. Like my man kick, kick, has, running after the bus, bro. He has fingerprints on <laughs> all three of these like... goals. <laughs> all three of the goals have got Martinez's fingerprints on them. What do you mean? All three of the goals, I'm not happy with him you for. You bigging him up last week. I just said he's had a brilliant season three so far. Three of the goals, far. how are you going to all... blame him for a free kick? You want to see how the free kick got given away. All three of the goals, he's got fingerprints on. He knew that was his worst performance in the United shirt. But here, Lindelof... Whoa, 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 whoa. Worse than um, 4-0 at Brentford? Yeah. Yeah. He had fingerprints on three goals in this game. It was his worst performance. 4-0? Yeah. Brentford? Yeah. This is worth? Yeah. He was at fault for three goals here. So this one, Lindelof, I don't know where he's coming. I said bullshit. 
Hernandez. <laughs> he, he's coming all the way with Ollie Watkins into mm-hmm. midfield. Yeah, Lindelof is poor. dragged a way out Smoking. of position. R- R- Rashford, you got to make more of an effort, but Lindelof, you're the one yeah, who's caused the problem. <laughs> when the ball Rashford. goes into the little pocket, and I think it's Jacob Ramsey turns, Casemiro, yeah. first of all, he goes to cut off that run that Bailey's going to make. Then I don't know why he gets drawn to the ball with Ramsey. Mm-hmm. Martinez, he's just caught. He's just caught out. He's slacking. Like, but he had like, Martinez had a whole head start. He looked like he was holding his breath when he was running. But yeah, no, he wasn't catching him. Yeah, um, he definitely weren't catching him. That was poor. Seconds. The minute that he turns in there, it was horrible. But seven minutes in, in a away game, your centre-backs Seller, sellers all, cold. all the way there in sellers the field. Did he score two? No, Jacob Ramsey's goal was good as well. And then, th- and then the second goal, the, f- ugh, the ball comes into Martinez, no one, no one near him. Goes to control it, bounces on from his left foot to his right knee. We give away a foul, scored a free kick. The third goal is header. That's a game that he does not want to look back on. Been brilliant so far, but mm-hmm. that was a shocking day at the office for him. All right then, and that's the tactical breakdown with Hogan. Must so, have been tough breaking down his own team's mistakes, yeah. but he got through it. Some people will do it, you know. <laughs> So let's get into non-league star of the week. Remember, you can send the good, the bad, the ugly into the old one too at justhype.com. It should be somewhere down there. Now, this week's goal we got from a guy named Sam Cheney. Plays for Where FC. Where? 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 Where is what else? In where? Oh. Yeah. Here we go. So have a look at this. For Where FC, yeah? For Where FC. Goals out wide. Good Comes ball. into the box, headers out, rubbish clearance. Ooh, absolutely levers it. And if we look at that again and we bring it back a little bit, he's lucky his mate got out of the way there because he was about to get his head taken off. I think off. his mate knows about I think his mate, I think he's like, I think he's a he's a notoriously, he hits the ball hard because the way his mate like, it just got <laughs> yeah. out of the way. It's like if, you're, if you're lining up a shot, it's like you got to yeah, get out of the way. Get out of the way. So big up yourself, San Cheney. Good finish, good finish. Uh, where FC against, and that goal was against Ellsbury. Ellsbury? Um, yeah. I played for Ellsbury. Okay. Let's get into something else here. Is this goal or no goal? I don't understand what the Lionels and the officials are seeing here because to me... Workshop Town, big up Workshop Town. Let's see. Yeah, Workshop Town. Um, that's where this one's coming from. Did they end up losing the game or how did it finish? I'm not too sure. We need to look into that. But he chops Legs inside. Of course has a goal. What's it's it? the will. They it's didn't it, give it. it. The will. He's not give, they've not give it. They've not give it. They've not give it. Not give it. No. Look at the slow-mo. It's hit the wheel of the goal. Look at that. <laughs> Bam. It's a goal. It's a goal. But they, they, they can't have them goals with them wheels in there then. That's what I mean. In league games. That's then. what I mean. Can't have that. Because that is criminal. The geezer's got a goal robbed from him. That might pay 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 his uh, travelling fee. You know what I'm saying? A bit of dinner, one, two drinks on a Saturday night. You know what I mean? On his little goal <laughs> bonus. Might be a one How much is a goal bonus? He might get a little one at 150 or something. I spent the in your pocket, bro. <laughs> yeah, but at the end of the day, taking it out of a man's back pocket. Anyone want to give me a goal bonus? Up, Town FC, but yeah. I want to know if they went on to win the game or not, man. Well, um, no, they lost 2-1. Are oh, they lost? Yeah, they lost 2-1. Ooh. So that's criminal. In the criminal. FA Trophy. In the FA Trophy, so they've lost money as well. Big game. So the officials in that game robbing money out the player, uh, yeah, the yeah. club's back pocket. It's crazy. But that is all we have from non-league star of the week this week. You can send the good, the badly, and the yeah, ugly in to the old one too at justhype.com and we'll review everything that we've got coming up. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Let's get into the predictions. Um, Woodsy, well, congratulations. You won your first solo uh, week <laughs> of um, predictions. Obviously, you've been doing the you know, you've been doing the charity shield thing, innit? And sharing the spoils and that. But for, like now, your own, you understand <laughs> thoughts, your own about. thoughts and everything. Anyway, got, you, got the, the W. The win. Well done, well done. You got the you W. You done well, you done well. Hogan, you're on the verge of relegation. <laughs> that was a terrible um. week for me. But you know what it was? <laughs> I was smart with it, you know? Because yeah. I thought I'm going to... Get used that into a false sense of security and then just boom, bag of sand each for the World Cup. 
Okay, you know okay. I mean? oh. okay so but what's I ain't gonna lie, eight out of twelve is outstanding. It's a good yeah. week. That was a good week, man. Great week, man. But I think week. what was outstanding is going back to week two, week three, back to back. That is myself. outstanding. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Isn't that it? is outstanding. Anyway, anyway, great, like, let's no, get into this week's, yeah? Anyway. Let's see, let's see what's gonna happen <laughs> for the next week. So what Saturday we got coming the 12th, up? Um, you don't want me to just go crazy this week? Yeah, real foolish, right, man. Let's go crazy, man. Man City, Ber- Brentford. City. Man City's City. home. City, City. City. Lim- I'm going to say... You know what you're going <laughs> to say. City, City, City. <laughs> Liverpool, Southampton. Liverpool it's winning. Liverpool win. Um, Bournemouth, Everton. Ooh. Hoo-hoo. I'm going to go Everton. I'm gonna I'm 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 gonna predict last car. Everyone's used to copies me. I'm gonna go Everton. I'm going draw. Great okay. shot. <laughs> West Ham Leicester. I'm going with a draw. I'm going Leicester. I'm going draw as well. Tottenham v Leeds. I'm mm. gonna go for summer summer dude. Late <laughs> equalizer. Late e- oh I like that. Draw. I'm gonna go Tottenham. I'm gonna go Tottenham. Forest v Palace. Palace. Mm. I'm gonna go for Forest win. Forest win. Yeah. I'm gonna go Palace. You know, I think that that could work. A few mm-hmm. dribblers against Forest. Mm-hmm. Newcastle Chelsea. Ooh. I'm gonna go against the grain here. Everyone's gonna think Newcastle gonna do it, but I'm just gonna go with name. I think Uber's Uber. I think Uber's gonna be too much for Dan Burns and them. And <laughs> I'm gonna go with Chelsea. <laughs> okay. <coughs> um, I'm going to go with a draw. I'm going to go against the grain myself and I'm going to go New, Newcastle That's and Almiron. <laughs> That's not against the grain. I mean, Chelsea's the, the biggest team in where? Uh, yeah, but they, oh, they, yeah, West they London. are. They've West got London. two Champions <laughs> Leagues, bro. You know what I'm saying? Two yeah. Champions Leagues. That's all. Wolves yeah. against Arsenal. Is a new manager in charge for this one or no? Come on, the boys. Go on, Arsenal. Southampton mm-hmm. might have a new manager against Liverpool, actually. Nathan Jones from Luton. He's good. He played ball. Yeah. Um, well, hopefully um, he's not he's not in yet. Um, Wolves versus Arsenal. That should be oh, it's late on a Saturday. That's the shakiness. Under the lights at Molyneux. Ooh, look, bro, big teams lose late on Saturdays, you know. All right. Um, and Wolves have been so bad this Arsenal's season. Gonna are you, are you not going to make your predictions? I'm, I'm yeah, I'm going to go with a draw. You go with a draw. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go and say Arsenal's gonna do it. Oh, is it? Yeah. It's not like what are you? I haven't voted again. Or have I won two weeks back to back without calling Arsenal to win, bro? What up to you? You going for Arsenal? Yeah, I'm going. See, Arsenal. this is what confuses me though. He picked Arsenal to win every week, and so you must think they're in a title race. Yeah, but every that's his team. I'm not, I, I don't bet team. against Liverpool. <laughs> I don't bet against. Them. Nah, when they come up against do you someone, bet against I think they, when they come up, I don't bet against that. them. We're gonna find out. Yeah, I don't bet against them. Brighton versus Villa. Uh, Villa, I think Villa's gonna take him. Yeah, I think Villa. Luna, Emery, I think Bailey. Villa, Villa looking good right now. Brighton. They... Lalana was on fire against Wolves. Slowest Cruyff turn on. <laughs> Left <laughs> foot, right foot, right. every every yeah, foot Cruyff. Full of Man United, Fulham. You're getting the backlash. We're gonna beat Villa on Thursday in the Carabao. Then we're going to the cottage. I say. And we're going to slap them. If, if the six foot four striker starts, and I don't mean, or six foot three striker, or six foot, is it only six foot three or six Ew, foot Mitrovic. two? No, Ronaldo. Oh. If he starts, you lose. So, I don't think he starts in the Carabao. I'm going draw. You're going to draw? I'll go United. United. Yeah, I'll go United. I think they've, 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 they've had a rough couple of days. So I've got rough couple of days? Yeah. One defeat uh, in ten? They've had a rough couple of days. They've got, they got a bounce back. Yeah, they got no. a bounce back. So you think, man, so... Hogan, can you pull it back? Would oh. you, can you get back-to-back wins? Can I saw? get my title? Can I be the first to get three, three titles? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I want to put a score in it. Yeah. What, this week's predictions? Yeah, yeah score. No, nah, I don't feel confident about this week's predictions. <laughs> I love holding, I mean, see? It. That was the old one-two, people. Yeah. <laughs>